Hi, Washington Street friends. I'm excited to show you what we're going to do today. You see over here, I have a plant that is rooting in some water. And this plant is important to me because a friend of mine gave me a beautiful flower arrangement for Christmas. And when the flower arrangement died back and I went to throw away the stems that were in the flower arrangement, I found out something really wonderful, that they had roots on them. And this is a very special plant to me too because these plants grow in Illinois where I grew, grew up and they're called pussy willows. And the neat thing about pussy willows is that they have these little seed pods on them that feel like bunny tails. They're very soft and they're very fun to feel in your hand. So today, what I'm going to do is I'm going to plant one of these sticks with you. And the reason that I'm planting it is Reverend Patricia on Ash Wednesday, which is the first day of Lent, asked us to plant something in our homes. So I'm going to take some good soil, this is a special potting mix, to plant one of these plants. And I'm going to put a good bit of the soil into the pot. You can see. Ooh, it smells like good soil too. And then I'm going to make a little indentation to put my plant in. I'm going to take this one right here that I showed you, and you can see all of the roots on it. And I'm going to stick this down in the soil very carefully. Oh goodness, I even have roots that are going to be sticking up above this. I need to think about that. And I'm going to put some more soil on top of that. And what's going to happen is this little stick that was cut off and put in a flower arrangement at Christmas time is going to develop more and more and more roots grow into a beautiful, beautiful shrub for my yard. And I am going to be so excited to have it because it's a plant that comes from where I grew up and it will remind me of being a little girl and enjoying these little buds that are on the pussy willow. And the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to water this so that it'll get all the dirt nutrition all the hydration into this plant. And then later in the summer, I'm gonna put it in my yard, or maybe in the fall even, once it has some good solid roots. So let's talk about why we're doing this during Lent. If you think about Lent, that is a time in our church season where we try to draw closer to God and let God's word take root in our hearts. And the way that we do that is we remind ourselves of God's love every week and we talk about all the wonderful things that Jesus did when he was on earth with us before he died on the cross and was resurrected. And so just like this plant is going to take root in the good soil, God's word will take root in your lives as we journey through Lent together. Let's pray. God, thank you for the season of Lent. Help us to let our hearts be rooted in your word as we're reminded of all the wonderful things that Jesus did on earth. Amen.